Do you know the difference between the two types of Brutus Monroe designer toner sheets and how to use them? Hello and welcome to Karen's Creative Cards on YouTube. And in this video, I am sharing some beautiful cards I made with the new Thermoweb Brutus Monroe designer toner sheets and foils. In each package of designer toner sheets, you receive two clear and two white sheets that have the same pattern of toner that you can foil. So you can see this one is clear and this one is white. And in the card I'm going to show you, if you layer them together, it's a very beautiful effect. Um, the clear ones are also perfect for shaker cards and there are many different uh, techniques that you can use with both of them. I uh, created these two cards with the dry brush foil and the brush strokes white de designer toner sheets and some other new products also from Brutus Monroe and links to the blog post with more details on these cards will be in my description so this is the dry brush transfer sheets or foil um, that just came out from Brutus Monroe um, in collaboration with Deco Foil, and it is just gorgeous and then this is the brush strokes and again you get the clear and you get the white and it was the white that I used to make these two cards I did make a shaker card uh, just underneath the two peas and again more details will be on the will be on my blog on these cards and this is um, a rocker card so that was kind of fun and um, this is a beautiful stamp from Brutus Monroe and that is an embossing folder so more details will be on my blog regarding those cards I have uh, created several other cards with these um, and these new products. Um, this card was made with the Tide Pool. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's really pretty Tide Pool uh, transfer sheets and the clear marble. Um, so this is what the white looks like in the clear. You can see through it. And so on this card, um, the clear acetate, um, you can see through it to the beautiful aqua blue of the card base um, and again more details will be on these on my blog regarding these cards um, this fall card I made with the sunrise uh, transfer sheets and the stressed and marble designer toner sheets and this leaf I double foiled which you're going to see um, in the demonstration and this one I did some sponging um, on the white parts so um, very easy to make lovely cards for whatever season with these new products from Decofoil and Thermoweb and Brutus Monroe um, this is the card that I am going to make with you today or at least show you the parts I have my um, mink set to three. I have the mink mini, which fits right next to me um, where I work. And um, I have put um, some red, radiant red Gina K fancy foils. So it has the, those stars that move. Um, a piece of that over the clear designer toner sheet and that's all you need to do to and in a sheet and run it through and then I have the glittering green fancy foils foil which again has those stars that sparkle and that is over the white designer toner sheet and we will run that through and both of these are the coffee rings which uh, again there is clear and then there is white and this is the coffee rings designer toner sheets from Brutus Monroe
once it goes through, you have, I know it's clear, what can I put it on? The coffee rings are now a sparkly red. And the green is now a sparkly coffee rings on white. And these beautiful pieces that are left, you don't want to waste any of that gorgeous foil. So what we're going to do is take a black toner sheet and put this foil on top, put it in the carrier, and run it through. And we're going to do the same with the red foil um, with that had gone through once. And we're going to foil it again on a black toner sheet. In the meantime, I'll show you the other products that I used to make this card. I have these beautiful layer, layering uh, radiant ornament dies from Birch Press Designs. And I used layer A and layer C um, on these the double foiled uh, toner sheets that I'm going to show you in a minute. Um, I'll just finish that thought. And then this is the Decofoil toner sheets that you can purchase. And that was the black sheets that we did the double foiling technique with. So now you just take this foil off. There's very, very little waste. And these gorgeous, sparkly, starred foil um, is available for um, die cutting or uh, any anything you might want on your cards. And I'm going to take the green off. And once again, gorgeous foiled sheets. This is what it looks like when you layer the red on top of the green. So you had your clear sheet and you can put it right over the green. Um, I attached on my card the clear to the white with some micro glue dots. Um, and I'll try to remember to put a, a link to them. Um, you can just slip those right underneath a piece of the red and they don't show um, as you can see on my card. And then I die cut the ornaments um, from Birch Press Designs out of these pieces um, that I did um, earlier. And the um, smaller red one is a memory box die that I put on the inside. Um, I layered the red sparkly ornament on top of the green and attach the two together and made that gorgeous ornament there. Mary and Bright is um, a Tim Holtz Sizzix um, die and again that's from Memory Box. So our layered uh, Christmas card is complete. Links to all of the ThermoWeb, Decofoil, and Brutus Monroe products I shared in this video are in my description box, and I hope you decide to give them a try. Please share if you do, and thanks for watching, sharing, and subscribing, and helping me share the joy of creativity.